Good morning and welcome everybody to my channel. My name is Jakub Vanish and today I'm gonna be reacting to the brand new trailer of The Rings of Power Season 2 that has just dropped on Amazon. Uh, I cannot wait, I haven't seen it yet. So let's do this together. Three, two, one, let's go! Mordor! An evil. Golden Prime logo. Ancient and powerful. And here he is, Halbrand, aka Sauron. What's this? Prepare yourselves. Galadriel. Is there Gilgalad? Elrond, okay. This looks like a cool fight. Moths. Worms is way inside. Oh, there are some silhouettes. This this is cool. Maybe ants? We wanted ants in the first season. Maybe we get them here. I call Brimbor. I think he has been here. I think he's been here among us all Sauron along. Sauron is there. Ah! Oh man, he looks totally like his human form. So this is Anatar. The visuals are great. Every oh man, this Middle Earth is in sea monster. Casa Doom being destroyed. Orcs are looking mighty well. And here we have them, the Rings of Power. For elves, for dwarves. Arondir. Eagles there to save the day again. Isildur survived. <laughs> surprise, surprise. And the recast Aidar. Adar. This was cool. He's so cool. Uh, <laughs> I don't think these two shots are related to each other. That's just the magic of editing. Rings of power. Mm -hmm. New season, August 29th. Okay, okay, nice. All right, so it's gonna be eight episodes as of August 29th, and it's gonna be weekly release, uh, unlike unlike uh, with the with the Fallout. So, yeah, this was this was quite cool. I'm not a hater of the season one, though. I think you know the season one, you know, was looking very expensive. This looks even more expensive, honestly speaking. Like the visuals are really great, the masks and the CGI is really, really awesome. Though I think sometimes the casting choices were not the best, and I think the biggest issues with the season one were in the writing because, yeah, this is coming from some Lirion. Oh my God, that's a tongue twister. And uh, they, yeah, they mm, butchered some of the materials in the season one. I hope they will try to fix what they butchered in the season two, but you never know. So this looks like in the season two, we're going to be following Anatar, which is the elf form of Sauron, you know, the shapeshifter. It is weird that they don't recognize him, to be honest, because like this is the same actor. I didn't, I didn't expect it to be honest. This is the same actor, same face. They didn't rec recognize this is Sauron, even though Galadriel, you know, knew Sauron is, you know, Halbrand. Uh, so yeah, let's see how how that works out. But it looks like in the second season they will forge all of the rings already, uh, and maybe or yeah, I don't think that they will give them to to all of the all of the kings, etc. But there is a siege, a siege of Eregion, the, the uh, mighty elven city. So we're going to get a big, big battle likely towards the end because this is when Sauron is coming to, to pick up the ring. So this, yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Honestly speaking, I'm a bit more excited about uh, the announcement about Andy Serkis movie, The Hunt of Gollum, um, and, you know, the involvement of uh, uh, Peter Jackson, etc. This... This is still good, but I was much more hyped before the first season than uh, honestly after the first season it died down a little bit on me. Um, what was interesting in this trailer though is they didn't show, I think, any hard foods, which were like what 40% of the story of the season one. Maybe they were listening to the fans, they realized that you know fans are not really looking into that. We also didn't get this weird Gandalf wizard guy i still hope he is a blue wizard rather than gandalf it would be such a weird origin story um but otherwise okay we we got uh, yeah all the all the people from the season one even the new additions that they created on top of tolkien's world work but like i said this looks like they will be forging the rings of power and then siege the Eregion city um so likely that would mean that they will probably have to dilute the material into like four or five seasons so we're in for a long run um though 
you know this came quite fast like they didn't take a huge break you know to bring the second season so let's see how fast they can keep uh, you know coming with those so let me know what you think about it in the comments i really want to hear your opinion um otherwise you know if you like this type of content leave a like or hit a subscribe button that would make my day of course uh, and i wish you a great day everybody cheers and bye bye